I have three daughters ages five, three, and three months at the time of Christmas. And today I'm gonna to be talking all about stocking stuffers and what high quality thoughtful gifts we are putting in our girls' stockings. Hey guys, Sarah here from Work Life Glue. I am going to be doing Vlogmas this year. I am not going to be posting every single day, but I'm gonna be having a lot more videos this December. And I wanna be sharing a lot about our Christmas and how we're celebrating and giving you guys some tips and ideas. And I know a lot of you guys have reached out and said you love my gift videos and what we do and you always wait to buy until I post these. So I'm trying to get them out early for you. But today I'm talking all about stocking stuffers for my three daughters. I try to really give equal things across the board and give similar items so that, you know, they're not comparing and feeling left out or anything like that. But obviously with a three month old, she has no clue what's going on. So she definitely is getting items in her stocking, but it won't be as many things. By the third daughter, we have more than enough baby toys and stuff. So I didn't wanna just fill her stocking with a bunch of random stuff. But I got most of these items on Amazon as well as Target. And I will link to as many as I can find in the description so you can snatch some up too if you find anything you like. Let's start with candy. We don't like to do a ton of candy in our kids' stockings and I feel like we're still eating through all the Halloween candy. It's just candy, 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 it never ends. But I don't think a stocking is complete without candy. So these items were bought at Target. We always do the little candy cane full of candy. Our three-year-old loves Reese's, so she got those and our five-year-old loves Kit Kats. They received Pez dispensers a year or two ago and still love them, but it's really hard to find the Pez refills. If you guys know where you can easily find them, let me know. But they love LOL dolls, and so when I saw these, I had to buy them. They are mystery, so you don't know who you're gonna get, and they're Pez dispensers, and they come with six Pez candies each. So hopefully they'll get different ones so we can tell them apart. And then lastly, I thought these were so adorable. These are Hershey's Cookies and Cream, which my husband and I both just loved growing up. I'd always get one of these at the end of a grocery shopping trip as a little treat. But these are Build a Snowman Hershey's, so they can cut them apart and then like build the snowman with the arms and the legs and everything, just so cute. I just thought my girls would love that to be able to play while they eat. So like I said, I like to give really thoughtful, useful gifts in their stockings. I don't like to do stuff that's just like filler that's gonna be junk around our house. So I do spend a little bit more on these, but it's stuff that we will actually use. And I was really racking my brain trying to think of something that would be helpful for us. And our girls love to have hot chocolate in the living room and watch movies on Friday nights. But the problem with that is they end up spilling the hot chocolate everywhere. So I was like, what could I find that would work well for us to solve this problem and fit in their stocking? So I got these super cute mugs. They have lids, they are insulated, and the lid is really, it has a really nice seal and it twists so that it can open and close. So while it may still leak a little bit if it spills, it's a lot less likely to leak all over and um, it's you know insulated so it'll stay warm and it's not burning their fingers and they have really cute designs. I got three, one is still coming so that all three girls will have one for when our baby gets older. And so I got a unicorn one, a mermaid one, and then a butterfly one is coming as well. And they have ones that you know boys would like better so these are really cute and they're the perfect size for little hands and you know hot chocolate these would be great like also in the car for like going to look at the christmas lights so that they're not spilling it everywhere and burning themselves and covering your vehicle with hot chocolate and they also each come with a spare lid which i thought was really helpful and useful and probably will get used eventually like many kids my girls absolutely love crafting we have like a little craft corner now in our dining room where they have craft supplies out and something i gave them was my old washi tape but a lot of it like the stickiness isn't really working anymore and so at target i picked up um, one for each of my two older girls of washi tape sets. So I got this one which has like flamingos and water drops and pink stripes. And then I got this one which is glitter. They will love those. And then also in the crafty realm, I got three different sets of these Melissa and Doug 
created by me magnets and they actually came as a set which I thought was really cool so enough for all three daughters obviously our baby can't do these but I'm sure the older girls will do them for her my girls love to hang stuff on the fridge either at their house at our house or at my parents Nana and Grampy's house and so if we could even you know turn this into a gift for them we could paint them for Nana and Grampy to put on their fridge or we can use them at home so they come with little like rhinestones and paint and paint brushes and they can decorate them. We have a heart set, a flower set, and a butterfly set. They are gonna love those. Another fun thing I am putting in their stockings, I'm not quite sure they'll fit so they may sit on the mantle, but I got each of them a game. Now we love to play games at our house, but you know it's still hard with a three-year-old and a three-month-old they aren't fully into games yet obviously our three-month-old isn't um, but you know I think it's fun especially on car rides and stuff like that to have something to do or in a restaurant or even you know at home after supper so I got these ones that are just really compact really easy to play so two of them are called guests in ten so it kind of reminds me of like catchphrase or taboo you have a clue card and it gives you you know a thing a place for this one that you have to try to get people to guess in 10 um, questions I think is how it works so this one is all around the town this one is guess in 10 animal planet so there's different animals they have to guess and then I grew up loving the game spoons we just played with a deck of card and actual spoons but I just thought this would help us remember to actually play it because it all comes in one um, so I got this as well it's pretty much a tradition now to give our girls an LOL doll every Christmas um, I thought these were really cute because they're already you know shaped like a gift our baby obviously has no clue what LOL dolls are so we just got them for our two older girls but they will love these I also got a very practical gift which is a three pack of these ice packs my girls are always getting hurt and they love to get out an ice pack and so I thought it'd be cute to have these animal ones and they're soft and um, the ice pack you know can come out and go in the freezer like that or you could just put the whole thing in so they're each gonna get one in their stocking one's a reindeer one is a unicorn and one is like a little duck Queen or king or something I don't know really cute though and they also can be heated up to use warm as well something fun for our baby we got her this little teether it basically looks like a pink Oreo with um, like the silicone beads that she can also chew on and it has a little um, clasp so you can clasp it onto her clothes and she can chew on it when she gets a little bit older something I'm really have been looking for is something for my girls to do when we're shopping which we haven't been doing a lot of but hopefully one day we'll be back in stores and I wanted something for them like I could easily hand them they can do in stores instead of like begging for everything or arguing with each other or trying to get out of the cart and so I got each of them a set of flashcards so for our baby we actually had this set when our oldest was a baby but it's been like chewed up and it's wrecked and most of it is gone anyway so I got a new set these are just like first words and these will be so cute for her to just like look through when she starts talking she can say the word we can ask her to find different things on there and it just has simple words that are like objects that a baby first learns and knows what they are for our three-year-old she is learning her letters so I got a letter set by the same maker and it has the letter on one side and then pretty much all animals on the back that start with that letter and then for our five-year-old she is starting to read and so I got a set of sight words that have a ring on it so you can put as many or as few on it as you want and then we can take it along and she can practice her sight words these would also work great in the car at the doctor's office at restaurants play dates things like that where you just need to keep them occupied for a little bit of time I feel like a girl's stocking isn't complete without some kind of like chapstick hair supplies or something like that I always have had those growing up my mom still puts them in my stocking so for the girls I got them each of our two older girls I got them each one of these lippy pals from lip smacker they're really cute little animals they're kind of bigger and they have a cute head I think these will be easier to keep track of than the smaller size 
um, chapsticks and things like that because the head is a lot bigger so you can find it around the house and it'll be easy to tell apart whose is whose. I also got, I'll just put these in whoever's stocking, it's not a big deal, I'll put one in one and one in the other. Um, at Target they had these cute little cat holders for hair ties that are different shades of pink and silver. And then we like these little spirally ones, um, especially for my older daughter who has a lot of hair. These really hold really well. They're a little bit smaller around so they will um, hold. She doesn't have like adult amount of hair. She's still a kid so these will hold really well. And they're all different colors. And then on Amazon I got this set. I did not realize how many would be coming but my girls are gonna just flip when they see these. These are different sets of nail stickers. We always do during movie night when they can have their hot chocolate and their popcorn, we do, um, I do their nails. And so um, I got all these different kinds of nail stickers. There's different designs. They are gonna love these. They'll feel so cool. Like they have their own little manicure at home. And then lastly at Target in the stocking stuffer area, they had different Lego sets. And so I got one that is basically Cinderella and a little castle. I thought my girls would love that. My three-year-old's going through a huge princess phase. So she will just flip out when she sees this. And then I also got this Christmas tree one because how cute would it be to have your Legos celebrate Christmas? So that's everything. I do also want to add in bath colors. They haven't come yet, which we like to do every year. They're basically kind of like bath bombs, but instead of like fizzing, they turn your bath different colors. So I will link to those below. We'd love to give those for Christmas. You can also do like bubble bath. And then I'm also on the hunt for like a chunky drawing pad that just has solid paper in it and a lot of pages, but not too big and not very expensive. They had them at Target the last couple years. I haven't seen them at my local Target lately, but I'm still in the market for one of those because my girls love to color and I like that it's contained. So I'm on the hunt for those as well, but that will be everything in their stockings this year. I would love to know what do you put in your kids' stockings? Head over to our community tab and you can find the thumbnail for this video and comment there since our comments are disabled from YouTube. But I hope you guys are all having a very Merry Christmas. Make sure you check back soon for more videos as I am participating in my own version of Vlogmas. Merry Christmas, guys. Bye.